Here with Brandon Rios. Brandon, uh, you went up there and the first thing you said is, you know, I fought my heart out and I gave it everything I could, but he was too fast. That was the determining factor, was just his speed in this fight, right? Yeah, man, he was very fast. Uh, faster than I expected. Uh, he came in, you know, I came in top shape, he came in top shape. It was, I think what, what killed me was his speedness. I didn't think he was that fast. Uh, in the first round, it looked like a slip. They ruled it a slip, but when you kind of look back at the replay, it looked like a knockdown. What did you see there? Did you feel anything there, or did you think you just slipped? Uh, it was a slip. Uh, I didn't feel nothing. I was never hurt in the fight. It was just a slip. Uh, uh, I don't know if I slipped on the, the, in the middle ring or something, but it was a slip. Uh, I never was hurt. Yeah, you, you talked about uh, coming into this fight, how you had an iron chin, and you showed that tonight. You took all of his punches. You, you smiled through through all of them and showed everybody tonight that as fast and as strong as Manny Pacquiao is, uh, your chin still still to the stood the test against him. You know what? Honestly, uh, I didn't feel his power as much. I think I got more stunned with Alvarado than his punches. I never I never felt his punches. That odd. I think what killed me was just his penis and awkwardness. He's very awkward and he throw punches on different angles. I think that's what killed me, but hey, I tried my heart out. Like I said, I came in top shape. I tried to follow the game plan and it just fucked me. Yeah, usually we're used to seeing you throw, let your hands go and throw more punches and be the aggressor, but it, at what point did you feel like, oh crap, because you kind of kept your hands up and you weren't throwing as much as we're used to seeing you throw. It's just like every time I throw, uh, I felt like I was gonna get countered. But like I said, the, the hands grew, that was it, but. Uh, Packer did a great job, man. I, I, I tip my hat off to Packer on his team. But I tell one thing, though. Freddie Roach, I ain't no buddy journeyman fighter. Uh, he was not going to stop me four rounds, six rounds. I was coming to fight. I tried to win. I bring my heart out, and he never hurt me. And Manny knows that it, in the interview after the fight, he said he was so tough. I hit him with everything that he had, and he just would not go down. Uh, he gave you a lot of credit for being able to take everything that he gave you and continue to stay on your feet all 12 rounds. Yeah, you know, like I said, it, <laughs> yeah. he did grant me some good shots, but I never, like I said, I never got dazed. It was just, uh, I think tonight the factor was the speed. Hey, oh, man, it just hurts. It hurts deep down the side because I turned... I trained my ass out to win, you know. I fucking five months. Obviously, visi visibly upset, but a really stand-up guy to give us the interview, Brandon Rios. You want to finish? Yeah. Like I said, it hurts. It hurts me bad because I, I like I worked my ass out so hard. Five months in the gym, training, training, training. And I think this was the best camp ever. It happens. It goes the other ways, but fuck it. I'll bounce back. You, you learn from your mistakes, and I'll come stronger. And you didn't lose to a bum. You didn't lose to anybody. You lost to Manny Pacquiao. I mean, and you held your own. You stayed on your feet. It's, it, it, he's still, you think he's still one of the pound-for-pound pound greats with, with what you saw tonight? Oh, yeah. yeah you know, so, he's still up there, you know. Yeah. Uh, he still got it. I think it's just the speed, man. He's very fast, very awkward. I think that's what did it. But other than that, um, I don't know, man. It's just, it just hurts. It hurts. It hurts really bad. It feels like I let my team down. That's what to me it feels like. I let my team down because I tried and we worked so hard and we were so confident and everything. It just that's what it hurts. Your team's standing by you right now, and they're all so very proud of you. They have your back no matter what, Brandon. So I appreciate I appreciate the time. Thank you. Thank you.